Five Nights at Freddy's. I have not played this game. I only know a little bit about it. And I've never played a horror game in my life. And I'm already regretting this decision. The lights are off. The room is completely dark. I have a drink in my hand. Oh boy. And I've already taken a piss. Okay. New game. <sighs> Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Family pizzeria looking for security guard to work the night shift. 12 a.m. Okay. Oh god, I'm so paranoid already. I should mention this video will probably be from a possibility of 10 minutes if I can't play anymore. 2.45 Oh shit, I'm already going. Pick up the phone. Where's the phone? Oh! Oh, hello! Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact, so I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. You'll be fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. It's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night, too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children, and we need to show them a little respect. Right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free-roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too. But then there was the bite of 87. Yeah, it's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now, concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, They'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wires, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth pop out the front of the mask <laughs> Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first day should be a breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. Okay, let's go. Everyone is uh, here. Kind of figuring out the controls there in the beginning. Ah, oh, crap! I have a power camera to save on. Okay. Oh God! I'm already so freaking paranoid. God, this is almost like my actual room. The only thing I have running right now is a fan.
I expect this, uh, this first part to hopefully be easy, right? I'm supposed to survive to 6 a.m. said the note. Yeah, thank God the tutorial call kind of already took up most of the night. Whew. Oh shit, where's the other one? Oh hi. Um, 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 where is everything? Oh my god, is that... Everything has moved, and this person's coming out of here. And... Monster is not there. Where the hell do we go? Uh, if I haven't given off one, it's kind of obvious now. If you don't like cussing, um, yeah, gonna happen. Sorry. Yeah. say more already. Okay, drink, drink. Okay, let's listen to our friend here again.
gotta be kidding me. No. Hello? Hello? Well, if you're hearing this and you made it to day two, uh, congrats. I, I won't talk quite as long this time since Freddy and his friends tend to become more active as the oh week progresses. No. Uh, it might be a good idea to peek at those cameras while I talk, just to make sure everyone's okay. in their proper right, place, honestly. you know. Uh, interestingly enough, Freddy himself doesn't come off stage very often. I've heard he becomes a lot more active in the dark, though, so, hey, I guess that's one more reason not to run out of power, right? Uh, I also want to emphasize the importance of using your door lights. Uh, there are blind spots in your camera view, and those blind spots happen to be right outside your doors. So if, if you can't find something, or someone, on your cameras, uh, be sure to check the door light. Uh, you might only have a few seconds to react. Uh, not that you would be in any danger, of course. Uh, I'm not implying that. Uh, also, uh, check on the curtain in Pirate Cove from time to time. The character in there seems unique in that he becomes more active if the cameras remain off for long periods of time. Uh, I guess he doesn't like being watched. I don't know. Uh, anyway, I'm sure you have everything under control. Uh, talk to you soon. Um, no. I kind of need your voice. I've already used 20% of my freaking power. The bird dude is, um, there. There's, um, no, there's bird dude. So that's funny. Or the other one's, okay, they're both counting. Apparently there's something in there, so that, that's the guy that's popping out earlier. Okay. God, if this isn't recording, I'm gonna be so angry. So, um, how's your Halloween been? Uh, you know, just wanna know before I die. Yes, we've got this. Is that something at the end of the hall? No. Okay, where's the other one? steps. Oh my god, I'm sorry, oh hi. I'm sorry if I don't commentate a whole lot, it's not even extremely paranoid, I'm just kind of... <clears throat> well, I want to check anything in... What? 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 What's this? I should have just closed the door. Okay, if the light doesn't turn on, close the door. Just close it. <sighs> Holy crap. I don't want to do this. Holy 
<laughs> There's some there. There's one there. Oh, God. No phone call? Come on, dude. Who are you gonna call, right? It's okay if I barely survive with 1% power, because barely surviving, shit, is, uh, barely surviving is still surviving. I don't know where you, crap, crap. Okay, this door is the one that the light didn't work on. So. Oh my freaking god. Which takes my brain a moment to react to that. <laughs> I'm sitting there thinking, oh god, there he is.
birdies in the kitchen. Okay, cool. Uh, that or the birdies outside. Oh, hi! You're both right there. Just wonderful. It's 3 a.m. I'm using up way too much power. Come on! in this place. Where's the janitor? After this one. <laughs> holy, holy hell. <sighs> oh, crap now. Phone calls? Freddy suit, 
uh, try playing dead, you know, go limp, then there's a chance that uh, maybe they'll think that you're an empty costume instead. Nice. Then again, if they think you're an empty costume, they might try to stuff a mental skeleton into you. I wonder how that would work. Yeah, never mind. Scratch that. It's best just not to get caught. Right. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll leave you to it. See you on the flip side. I, I mean, I, oh, from, the, from the looks of the hallways, it looks like it's forever away. I don't know, maybe this is... Just Mr. Bird. Where the oh shit. Not cool. Not oh my god, everything is blacking 